Hello, hello. I'm pleased to meet all of you. I am Edgar Allan Poe, an American poet writer, a short story writer, an hour story writer, and also the first person who wrote an detective story. I was born in 19th January 1809. When I was a baby, my father left me, and my mom died when I reached three years old. I was adopted by a man, John Allen, and his wife, Frances. I studied language at, at Virginia University. As a coincidence, my wife was also called at Virginia. When we moved to New York, my stories became famous and my alcohol problem began. Now, you are going to see some of my tales. Thank you. Grandpa, Grandpa, can you tell me a story? I love your stories. Of course, my little grandson. Please, have a seat. I'm gonna tell you something that happened in my past. Cool! A long time ago, I received a letter from a friend of mine named Usher. He was inviting me to spend some days at his home because he was sick. When? And when I get there, But she was, and one day, sir, I'm afraid to tell you, but your sister is dead. Oh God, I knew that they was coming. <laughs> I'm sorry, my friend. There's anything? Uh, is it, there's anything can I help you to do? Uh, come, my friend. Help me to take her to the old room before burying her. We we have to make sure she's not dead. Okay. Good, good. Days passed since his mother and was dying. Uh, Usher wasn't the same. He was weird, cold, and in a dark night. Come, my friend, you must succeed. Get off of this window. Have a seat. You are, you are too much worried about your sister. I read that I swear for you. And Nelton lifted his sword, he stuck into the door with the half rose. He cracked it and broke into the door, apart to, uh, so that noise of the dry and the hollow sound of the wood seemed to flee the forest. Then God the Elder, entering through the door, was surprised to find a terrible creature standing guard in front of a place of gold with a flower of silver. And on the wall there there's words were writing, Who enters here <coughs> has won a victor, he who kills the guard shall win the shield. Crazy fool! I told you that she's now outside the door! <laughs> <laughs> 